storm blew me away. Blew the whole circus away. McDonald's represents happiness with its smiling clown, but some McDonald's locations are absolutely horrible. Keep watching to learn the 10 untold truths about the world's worst McDonald's. Ottawa, Canada. 911 emergency operator 625, what is the address of your emergency? In Ottawa, Canada, on Rideau Street, there's a McDonald's with a bad reputation. It's one of the scariest golden arches in the world. The Ottawa McDonald's will be closing its doors after 38 long years due to an increase of social disorder. It seems the Ottawa McDonald's has become a home for hooligans. In this once happy and fun location, you'll now find drug deals, intimate acts in the bathrooms, and numerous fights between customers. One man even pulled a baby raccoon out of his coat during a massive brawl at this location. In one year, the Ottawa police received over 800 calls to intervene at the location. The infamous social media hype gave this McDonald's the title of worst McDonald's in the world. Sadly, one of the reasons for all this chaos is the McDonald's location. It can be found in the heart of a tourist district between many bars and restaurants. After hours, many will flock to the McDonald's for a snack and something to drink. The city of Ottawa and McDonald's have tried to lessen the illicit and dangerous activities, but nothing seems to have worked. The Ottawa McDonald's even reduced their hours and stopped serving customers 24 hours a day. However, this caused a drop in revenue, hence another reason for the closing. This worst McDonald's will be closing its doors in April 2023, if you want to knock it off your McDonald's bucket list. Kings Winford, England this is a practice burger. Why are you whispering? I don't want it to hear and feel bad. The United Kingdom has about 1,300 McDonald's locations, and without a doubt, the King's Winford restaurant near Dudley is the worst. Nowadays, reviews can make or break a business. The King's Winford McDonald's is rated 2. Out of over 100 ratings, this McDonald's has more than 60 terrible comments. 11 are poor and 13 are average. Nothing close to acceptable can be found on the reviews for this English McDonald's. In these reviews, you'll find words like always missing items, poor quality, and be warned. A recent review for the McDonald's in Kings Winford is titled, Worst McDonald's in the West Midlands, You Decide. McDonald's spoke out and said that the reviews only cover a small amount of the population that are served at their location each day and that they always get five-star ratings during inspections. McDonald's encourages customers to reach out to the service team and crew if something isn't as expected or if they have a complaint. If you find yourself in Kings Winford near Dudley, try this McDonald's out for yourself and leave a review. This worst McDonald's location could really use the extra help. New York, New York. You always pick people up like this? Oh, yeah, you know, I like to keep things interesting. Welcome to New York. Thank you. Location plays a huge factor when it comes to determining if a business will thrive or sink. This McDonald's in New York City on Broadway is another that's centered in a busy and touristy part of the city. Found near Madame Tussauds Wax Museum, the fast food restaurant is rated a meager one on TripAdvisor. This NYC McD's is described as filthy, overpriced, and bloody awful. To get to the McDonald's, you'll need to push yourself through a horde of tourists and locals alike to get to the restaurant's doors. From there, you'll be greeted with a dirty dining area and an unsmiling staff who'll make you feel like you should be anywhere but there. If you do decide to place an order, be prepared for cold food, over greasy fries, and a long wait time. Several bad reviews for this McDonald's on Broadway warn you to watch out if you have to go to the bathroom or turn your back while you eat. New York has a big homelessness problem, and some have been known to grab your food and pass around money cuffs as you try to enjoy your meal. If you're searching for a peaceful place to stop and eat, you should consider one of the many other New York City McDonald's locations. First time here? Well then, take a quick second to hit that subscribe button. Thanks. Edinburgh, Scotland. No hamburger. Mr. Mayor said very specifically you were not to eat the food.
Scotland has 101 McDonald's locations, and apparently they should have stopped at an even 100. Wherever you go, McDonald's franchises should all be the same. But this Scottish McDonald's follows its own path. Customers have rated this McDonald's on Craigentinny Avenue North very badly. It only has a 2 rating on TripAdvisor. Words like disgraceful, shocking, and I won't be back scatter the review pages for this restaurant. Visitors to this McD's in Edinburgh have written stories about missing items from orders, wrong drinks served, and cold and soggy food. The bathrooms are repugnant, and asking for a roll of toilet paper when they're out will get you a death stare. The outdoor area of this McDonald's is described as a total disgrace, with garbage and food remnants everywhere. There are 10 McDonald's in Edinburgh, and if you're craving for a Big Mac, you should visit any other location than the one on Craigentinny. Here's a tip for any restaurant goer. If the outside looks disgusting, chances are the inside is just as gross. Caracas, Venezuela You have your own McDonald's? The McDonald's in Caracas, Venezuela might actually have two reasons to be on this list. The Venezuelan McDonald's is both a dreadful place to eat and it's one of the most expensive Golden Arches restaurants in the world. It's common knowledge that Venezuela has been suffering from an economic crisis for over a decade, but McDonald's should push for the same quality in all its locations worldwide, right? Especially one that could use the extra help in creating jobs and adding value to its operating area. Sadly, it looks like McDonald's is neglecting their restaurant in Caracas, and its quality is described as horrendous. The prices are also unbelievable. In a country that survives on low income and poor conditions, it's a special treat to be able to afford a $3 burger. In America, they started a buck. A full meal with a drink, burger, fries, and chicken nuggets will cost you about $20 US. And if you don't have the exact change, well, too bad because the McDonald's in Venezuela doesn't have any U.S. currency to give back as change. Also, don't ask for a bottle of water, they never have any of those either. The McCafe is rarely open because there are not enough employees to cover that part of the restaurant. Why, 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 why? Sydney, Australia hey, hey, hey. Uh, That's not decaf, is it? Viennese cinnamon. The McDonald's in Sydney, Australia on George Street is being completely shredded by its customers. When you first approach this Sydney McDonald's, it looks like any other Golden Arches restaurant found all over the world. However, upon further inspection, this McDonald's is strewn with garbage and filth. The establishment has dirty tables, counters, and an unclean service area. Strangely, the garbage bins are not overfilled in this location, it just seems the staff can't keep the area tidy fast enough, and the customers don't bother taking their trays and trash, they just leave things where they are when they leave. If you don't mind the mess and want to sit down and eat at this McDonald's in Australia, you won't be disappointed with your meal. The food is decent and the customer service is acceptable. The reason this McDonald's can be considered one of the worst McDonald's in the world is not for the restaurant itself, but for the uncaring and sloppy customers that eat there each day. Columbus, Ohio That look like spit to you? Yeah. Ah, f*** it. Columbus, Ohio is known for many things, like beautiful parks, numerous shopping destinations, and its delicious variety of food. But if you want a familiar burger, you might find yourself leaning towards the McDonald's on 17th Avenue. However, here are a few things you should know about this McDonald's location. It's another one of the worst ones in the world. The Columbus McD's on 17th Avenue has horrific service and is always out of something. Don't think about getting ice cream at this McDonald's, they never have any. You might also visit on a day they're out of forks, straws, or even lettuce. One thing that this McDonald's location never runs out of is its bad service. Employees will socialize and even fight in front of the customers and bark out, what do you want, as they glare at you to hurry up. It's as if most employees at this McDonald's in Ohio skipped their training session. Apparently, using a coupon when ordering your food order is also an impossible task making for confused employees. And don't expect eye contact, a smile, or a have a good day. If you don't want to go inside at this McDonald's, you can try the drive through but be warned, it's just as bad. Prepare yourself to speak up, because you'll be hearing, huh, with every menu item that you add to your order. 
Manhattan, New York. Hey, buddy. I got the good stuff. Ronald needs to turn that frown upside down because this McDonald's in Manhattan, New York, found on 34th Street, has been labeled the saddest McDonald's in the world. In this Golden Arches outlet, you will surely find a crying clown mascot instead of a happy one. The McDonald's in Manhattan is situated in an area where addicts find themselves flocking towards McDonald's, and when they do, trouble often ensues. Like some of the other worst McDonald's, this location is also known for its fights and a activities. Grabbing a bite to eat here is not for the faint of heart. A visiting customer at this sad McDonald's was recently stabbed in the buttocks without reason. Luckily, he's okay, but the suspect still hasn't been found. The Starbucks next to it is also known to be the saddest Starbucks in North America. So if you find yourself in Manhattan near 34th Street, you might want to think twice about eating in this restaurant and walk a few more blocks to the next one. There are currently 59 McDonald's on the island of Manhattan, so you won't have to go too far to find one. Bergheim, Germany I ordered this medium, and it's well done. Thank you. This Golden Arches location in Western Europe is recognized as a failure due to its bad hygienic conditions, rude customer service, and horrible food. If you visit this Bergheim McDonald's found in Germany, you'll first notice that their tables are rarely cleaned and the floors are not swept. Employees don't care about washing their hands, and they don't wear gloves to prepare the food. You don't even want to know about the bathrooms. You'll need to accept your meal as is because your complaint will be turned into a personal insult. The employees at this McDonald's have no empathy and no respect for their job. The cold meals and bad-mannered service will make you wonder if it's because of poor management or just because the employees want to have a little fun at your expense. Enjoy your meal here only if you're comfortable eating on a messy table and are willing to give your order to a gruff employee. Rio de Janeiro, Brazil How did you get here? Up. Look, pull yourself together, it's only a bit of poo. Did you know that Rio de Janeiro in Brazil is known to be one of the most unhurried cities in the world? Brazilians are famous for doing things casually, especially in Rio de Janeiro, and this is certainly reflected in its McDonald's in the neighborhood of Ipanema. The biggest issue with this worst McDonald's in the world is that it's slow. Very slow. If you're on a time schedule for your Brazilian adventure, don't expect a quick service here. Count on having a long wait time and having to interact with uninterested employees at this McD's in Brazil. The employees just don't care. But since the location of this restaurant is in a high-traffic area with many tourists and locals, the fast food franchise is always full, no matter how sluggish and casual the workers are. Your meal will probably be cold, there will most likely be mistakes in your order, and your shoes will surely stick to the tacky floor. Some of the customers, mostly tourists, will wait in line and make a purchase just to get permission to use the restrooms. They soon regret it, however. Reviews of this location say that the bathroom is one of the dirtiest bathrooms they've ever seen and filthy avoid at all costs. Customers who visit the McDonald's in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil soon find themselves turning around to find another place to go after stepping into the bathroom area. Looking for more? Just tap or click another video. First time here? Then leave us a comment, hit that subscribe button, and ring that notification bell.